now we are going to study the reflection at the curved surface okay now reflection at the curved surface so first the what is a spherical mirror a spherical mirror is a mirror whose reflecting surface is a part of hollow sphere of glass there are two types of spherical mirror one is convex mirror and other is concave mirror so what is this now consider this is a now consider this is a a hollow sphere okay consider this is a hollow sphere and we cut the and we cut this portion the right part this part this part looks like as look like as shown in figure okay okay this 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 cutting portion this portion it looks like this and uh, one surface is polished mm, consider this this surface is polished okay this polish this is polished surface U L I S H E D Polish surface. Okay. Now an other surface, this surface is ref reflecting surface, and this surface is polish surface. The light is entering in this surface. Okay. Not in this surface. This this uh this lens this mirror is called concave mirror okay this mirror is called concave mirror and what is is and what is convex mirror the convex mirror looks like if this portion if this portion if this portion become polished okay if this portion is polished become and this portion is polished surface and other surface is reflecting surface and this uh, mi mirror is called convex mirror okay now the definition of convex mirror the spherical mirror whose reflecting surface is away from the center of a sphere is away from the center of a sphere of which mirror forms a part of which mirror forms a part is called convex spherical mirror and the convex spherical mirror the spherical mirror whose reflecting surface towards the center of a sphere towards the center of a sphere of which the mirror forms a part is called a spherical concave mirror okay and this is a image of concave mirror and this is a concave mirror and this is a convex mirror this is the concave mirror this portion this surface is polished surface and this surface is reflecting surface light is entering in this surface okay and the point c the point c is called radi the point c is called the radius the point c is called the center of curvature and the radius cp the radius cp cp is called radius of curvature okay radius of curvature and the p is referred as a pole the midpoint of a and b 
a b is the mirror and the p is the midpoint so p is called pole okay and similar for the convex mirror okay for convex mirror this surface is polished surface okay polished surface okay or the side is surface to polish color the kitty at but this surface is reflecting surface okay so this is called convex mirror okay now there are few definition at first the center of curvature the center of the sphere of which the mirror forms a part is called the center of the mirror it is represented by the point C the previous picture okay and radius of curvature the radius of a sphere of which the mirror forms a part is called the radius of the mirror it is denoted by PC which is equal to R okay the pole the center the center of the spherical mirror is called the pole it is represented by the point P and the principal axis last what is principal axis the line joining of this pole the line joining of curve center of curvature and the pole is called the uh, principal axis okay see the definition the the straight line passing through the pole and the center of curvature of the mirror is called the principal axis of the mirror the line pc extended both way represent the principal axis of the mirror in this figure this is the the p, this is the p point p pole and this is the center of curvature the line joining of this two point is called an ex extended both side is called the straight line is called the principal axis okay in this figure you can see the details so this is the figure okay this is a b a b is the concave meter okay and c is the center of curvature and P is the pole and CP the distance CP the distance CP is called the radius of curvature okay and the AB the diameter AB the diameter AB is called the aperture of the concave mirror aperture the diameter AB is the aperture of the diameter okay and and the distance pc is the radius of curvature and the straight line passing through the point c and p is called the principal axis or that is x x dash so x x dash is called the principal axis okay and you see from the figure this is the principal axis principal axis and this is for concave mirror this is the center of curvature this is pole and a p b is the convex mirror and a b is the aperture of the aperture of the a p e r aperture t u r e aperture of the convex mirror okay and x x dash x x dash the straight line x x dash is called x x dash is called the principal axis okay
now this is the definition of aperture the diameter of the mirror is called aperture of the mirror the line joining of the point a b represent the aperture of the mirror okay the next is principal focus the point at which the narrow beam of light incident on the mirror parallel to the principal axis after reflection from the mirror meets or to appear or appear to come from is called the principal focus of the mirror it is denoted by f see the figure this is con okay this is concave mirror the parallel light is coming and after reflection meet at the point f okay so this point f is called the focus okay in this case the ray of light actually meet the point f okay but in this case actually do not actually meet the point f okay so this point f is called the principal focus okay now here there is some point in the case of convex concave mirror the ray of light incident parallel to the principal axis after reflection actually meet the focus f अर्थात बोलते हैं कि कॉन्केव मिरर ए एक्चुअली मीट करे। ऑन द अदर हैंड, इन द केस ऑफ कॉन्वेक्स मिरर, द रे ऑफ लाइट इंसिडेंट पैरेलल टू द प्रिंसिपल एक्सिस आफ्टर रिफ्लेक्शन डू नॉट एक्चुअली मीट द फोकस, डू नॉट एक्चुअली मीट द फोकस, डू नॉट एक्चुअली मीट द फोकस। ओके, व्हेन दिस रे व्हेन प्रोड्यूस प्रोड्यूस बोल छे जे जोकोन आमी see the figure जोको parallel light enter को छे convex mirror है किन्तो after reflection एटा एई पद दिये जाथ छे किन्तु तुमार चोक जो दिये काना थाके तुमार चोक की भाब्बे जे light टा f बिन्दु तेके आश छे ठीक आछे अथात light टा जेना मुने होच छे f बिन्दु तेके आश छे actually f बिन्दु तेके आश छेना वो जो नई पॉइंट है क्या बोला होता है कौन बेक्सर क्षेत्र है ये टाइप होता है फोकस पॉइंट ओके ओके फोकल लेंथ द डिस्टेंस बिटवीन द पोल एंड द प्रिंसिपल फोकस इज द फोकल लेंथ ऑफ द मिरर इट इज डिनोटेड बाय स्मॉल एफ ओके स्मॉल एफ एंड इट इज रिप्रेजेंटेड बाय स्मॉल एफ the distance pf in the figure see the figure this is the figure in this figure see the the, the distance p pole and the focus is called the um, focal length the, that is denoted by a small f okay and see the figure the uh, point f focus and the pole f p is called is called the focal length of the mirror okay okay so this is focal length okay p and f the distance between p and f is called the focal length okay this is focal length and the next there is a question which spherical mirror is called the divergent mirror and convergent mirror i think it need not have to explain easy question and the answer is given go through the answer okay next now the rule for tracing images formed by concave mirror and convex mirror okay what is the rule a first rule a ray parallel to the principal axis after reflection either actually passes through the principal focus f or appears to diverge from it ki bolche bolche je ekta parallel light jodi ete ashe मिरर पड़े कनके मिरर तेल आफ्टर रिफ्लेक्शन 
फोकस दिए पास हो ठीक है छविटा देखो फोकस दिए पास हो ठीक है ये छविटा और एर क्षेत्र की बोल कन्भेक्स लेंसर क्षेत्र की बोल इट्स एपियर टू डाइार्ज फ्रम द पॉइंट एफ ठीक है ठीक है तेल क्यों ये एक एक जदि लेंस है ये एक जो ले सरि लेंस बोल मिरर है ये हे कनके मिरर एक हे प्रसिपाल एक्सि प्रसिपाल एक्सिस एक्स एक्स डैश एक्स डैश ये हे पोल पी पैर लाइट आस पैर लाइट आफ्टर रिफ्लेक्शन को पॉइंट दिए पास कर फोकस पॉइंट जेटा जी फोकस पॉइंट एफ है फोकस दिए पास कर ठीक है एर बोझा गया कि बोल छविटा ओके द सेकेंड रूल कि बोल से हमें जो रे जो रे डायग्राम आँकब यह रूल हमारे क्या लागे ठीक है उ हाव टू यूज दिस रूल हाइल उइ हाव हाइल उइ हाव ड्रन दिक्चार और इमेजेस ओके द सेकेंड रूल इज ए रे थ्रू द सेंटर अफ कार्भेचर हुई स्ट्राइक्स द मिरर नर्माली इ एंड इज बैक इट इज रिफ्लेक्टेड बैक एलंग द सेम पाथ कि बोलिए जी को रे जदि सेंटर अफ कार्भेचर दिए आसे तो हमें आफ्टर रिफ्लेक्शन वही पद दिए चला जाए ठीक है जो पद दिए आस पद दिए चला जाए अर्थात ये जो एक कनके मिरर है तेल सेंटर अफ कार्भेचर ये पर दिए रे आस और ये पर दिए चले जाए बोझा गया कि बोले अच्छा नेक्स्ट ठीक रकम कन्फेक्स क्षेत्र से एक ही रूल ठीक है जे पद दिए आस पद दिए चले जाए ठीक है यहाँ हम सेंटर दिए पास है तो नेक्स्ट ए रे ए रे पासिंग थ्रू द प्रसिपाल फोकस एफ और ए रे हुई एपियार्स टू कनभार्ज एट एफ इज रिफ्लेक्टेड पैरल टू दिन्सिपाल एक्सिस तेल कि बोलते को रे जदि फोकस दिए गए कनकेब लेंसे पड़े तो आफ्टर रिफ्लेक्शन वो पैरल हिसाब से चले जाए बोझा गया कि बोलते जे को रे जदि पैरल ये एक हे कनकेब मिरर ओके ये हे कनकेब मिरर को फोकस फोकस दिए जी को रे जो आसे तेल आफ्टर रिफ्लेक्शन को पद दिए जाए एक्सिजे तर समान चले जाए पैरल चले जाए ठीक है एक ही रकम घटना हे कन्भेक्सर क्षेत्र द थार्ड रोल इज ए रे स्ट्राइकिंग एट द पोल पी इज रिफ्लेक्टेड सीमेट्रिकलि बैक इन दपोजिट सैड अर्थात देखो ये पथे एस पोले गए डायरेक्ट गए पड़े तो आई एक ही अंगेले चले जाए अर्थात ये अंगेल दो सेम थक अर्थात ये अंगेल और ये अंगेल ठीक है सेम थक दो अंगेल सेम थक अंगेल और ये अंगेल सेम थक एक ही रकम ये अंगेल और ये अंगेल सेम थक आय हम एट आय बोझा गया कि बोल ओके okay.